And welcome back, folks. Get ready. Yes, we have to try this again. Again. There they come. Second floor on the right. This is crazy. How can these people... Ah. Alright. This time I actually survived, funnily enough. Okay. Here they come again. Wow, man. This is insane. Um, what to do? Uh, they can tank a little bit, I think. Yeah. That little damage is insane. I really need something better. Um, but I don't really have anything other than nuclear grenades. Those are my only weapon that's any powerful. I can't waste it on just one enemy. Let's try to. Good thing we have those dogs and those turrets to support us, because without them, I don't think we'd have any chance here. Oh no. Next enemy. Life of a cop isn't an easy one, eh? Square between the eyes. I don't know where that hit, but it tore her apart. Yikes. Small people. You can't even properly hit her. trouble here. Um, let's drop some more crap. Another level action shotgun or rifle rather. Phew. The dogs cannot actually die from the looks of it. They can only be, um, you know, knocked out, which is helpful, I suppose. Where? Where for? Oh, God. They're right behind you, dude. Oh, no. A tribal with a freaking minigun? Are you kidding me? I think that justifies using a nuclear grenade, don't you? Not enough, but it did some damage, at least. Alright. Let's grab that minigun before any other tribals get any ideas about picking that up. Come on, come on. I get the I get the idea, Desmond. Thank you. Uh-huh. 
died like three times in all of this. Man. Insanity. Alright, I think we have to talk to Desmond now. Let's just quickly walk once around the block and see if there's anything of interest we're missing out on. Well, double barrel shotgun. I think I already, yeah, I can't really carry too much more. Let's just, let's just, let's just talk to the guy and then finish this. Man, there he is. Dude, what the hell was all that? So, my hero, think you came in and rescued me right in the nick of time. Not hardly. Had it all well in hand, and I didn't even need to use the failsafe. But that would have done a real number on some of the paintings, so just as well you were here. Anyway, name's Desmond. Hmm. What kind of failsafe is that? The type that kills everyone outside of my safe room and leaves a hell of a mess to clean up. Standard type. Not worth wasting on ignorant savages like them, honestly. Just as well you came along when you did. So, tell you what I'll do. I'll share a few tips for the next time you're making a dramatic final stand. Hmm. Superior defender has been added. You now do more damage and have better defense when standing still. Kind of interesting. Cool. Why were these tribals attacking you? Not a fucking clue. It'd be easy to chalk it up to their crazy religion. But if I'm right, and I always am, there's something else going on. That's the third attack in a month, so somebody's got a grudge with me. Whether it's a man or a god, I intend to set them straight. A god of the tribals? Is that the idea? Why would they attack here anyway? Damned if I know. It was abandoned when I got here. There's plenty hidden away here. None of it would be useful to a bunch of crazed inbreds. <laughs> Maybe they are here because of you. Have you seen a woman named Nadine? I've been around for a long goddamn time. The last time I knew a bird named Nadine, I still had skin. There was some girl who came nosing around here a few weeks back, but she ran off before I could introduce myself. You make that sound really awful. Tell me about Point Lookout. I'm here on my own business. You wouldn't understand it even if I tried to explain it to you. Great. I don't know why anyone would bother with this shithole. It's filled with a bunch of disgusting inbreds and half-crazed loons. I'm gonna do what I came to do, and then get the fuck out of here. <laughs> what do you know about those tribals? They're brainless morons who worship some crazy spirit. What's to know? Well, they have some motivation, clearly, for attacking with dozens of people. Well, I guess I have to go. Because there's nothing else I can talk to him about. Now hold on there. Not so fucking fast. You can be useful to me. I need someone willing to get their hands dirty. So here's the deal. I help you get in with those tribals. You help me get what I want. And I'll make you fucking rich. Just try not to sprain a lobe while you're thinking about it. My time is short. <laughs> well, what do you want me to do about the tribals? You need to learn to pay attention when I speak. Those mud lovers want me dead and haven't extended the common fucking courtesy of telling me why. So, I need you to find a way into their commune and figure out what's going through their addled little heads. How am I supposed Be to do that? Pup, and old Desmond will give you a treat. And of course, who knows what riches they have for you to steal. What kind of reward is that? The only reliable currency in the world. Information. You provide me with valuable info about the tribals. I pay in kind. I've got a few more tricks I can share with you, if that's not enough to get you barking. Okay, maybe another perk in it for me. How do I go about infiltrating them? Easy peasy. Right about now, they'll be wondering what happened to their hunting party. And I'm supposed to become a tribal now, like to replace the people we killed here. What? 
like you've never done something unpleasant for the promise of your own personal gain. Give it a rest, saint. Well, that's Just true. head up to the cathedral and ask real nice. When you're in, you'll find the bastard in charge and find out what they're up to. I just need information. No need for violence. Yet. Apart from all the violence we just did, of course. What's your story, man? My story? Tell you what, kid. My story's a lot like a death claw's tongue. It's long, messy, and you don't want to get too personal with it. Understand? Suffice it to say, I have business in Point Lookout. If you help, you will be repaid for your efforts. That's all you want to fucking know. I don't quite trust you. Don't know why. Can't put my finger on it. Why should I work with you again? What's the difference between you and me, kid? What makes a gifted killer like yourself into a rock-hard bastard like me? The answer is training, you ignorant fuck! I've got a hundred years of experience on you, and don't you forget it. Stick by me and you'll get a master's class in doing what has to be done. This actually sounds kind of enticing, despite what a bastard this guy is. Well, let's go. And see about joining the cult, I suppose. Back to business. Indeed. You know, he actually has some sort of style in his rude and uh, cursing manner. And he has a nifty suit. I'll give him that. Does he actually have a mustache? Huh. Weird. Okay, folks. Um... Well, so much for that. We suffered quite a lot in this, um, trying to defeat these tribals. I have to give them credit, they are a tough bunch. Um, what I'm gonna do is uh, I'll end this episode here. I'll go through this whole mansion again, looting, and when we return we'll see what we can do next. Desmond wants us to join the tribals. There's also the whole deal about the uh, about the Chinese agent, Yang, who's held very far in the north. Might also want to go there.